Formidable weapons of yesterday became cause for jubilation today. Only Lucas admiring some of the weapons. Lining up in military formation before Martin Kapembe, the commander, who takes the salute to the prime minister. The Prime Minister, accompanied by Chief of Staff, inspected the Guard of Honor mounted by plant forces. The sons and daughters of the People's Liberation Army of Namibia have finally, have finally and of handing this material, this material that brought about the war to an end and brought our independence to hand over to you, Mr. Prime Minister, where was you to defend the sacred soul of this nation, every inch of it, but probably also more important, to defend the fundamental law of this land, the constitution of the Republic of Namibia. Viva the Republic of Namibia! Viva! Viva Republic of Namibia! Viva! Viva Plain! Viva! Indeed, 23 years of armed struggle was not in vain. My task today, therefore, is to thank the Southwest Africa Business Organization Club of Namibia for having generously donated this impressive array of armament to the government of the Republic of Namibia. This indeed is a generosity at its best, considering 